video we encountered Leet Miss Magius, and I thought that and I thought that Leet Miss Magius was pretty cool. So I got myself my own Leet Miss Magius. I had a bunch of demons. Because I was like, ooh, let's use Memento. Because I saw that and I thought that might be decent for a lead. And I just got a bunch of setup threats that well they can come in safely now with Memento and setup. So that that was my thought process there. Sword Dance, Leafeon, Sword Dance, Drapeon, Sword Dance, Absol, Dragon Dance, Altaria, and Call Mine Our Kazam. They go Houndoom. And I'm literally just gonna memento right away. I could I could chip it with hitbound fighting, but I just wanna die. Wait, was I focused as I was? I probably should have been better than that. Uh so who do I wanna send in here? I always want to bring in Alakazam. I think I'll bring in Alakazam and substitute. What's up? And now I'll get up a calm mine. Aha. Uh -huh. And now we're psychic. Okay, he's still sucker punch there, so I don't get to keep my sub, but that's okay. It might go Houndoom, but I'll sub against that. Let's see, what comes in here? I don't think I'm gonna do work if, if they don't have a spirit tomb. Unfortunately, if they have a spirit tomb, that's scary. My team... Oh wow, we really don't like spirit tomb. Dawn fan. Ice shard. More strong. <laughs> More strong! Sub call, sub CM. Don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. Oh, I yeah, sucker punch. All right, I wasn't sure if we sucker punch a lot. So now we can bring in Dragon Dance or Tarya, yeah, maybe. Oh, they might go right here, here. Oh, they go Miss Machias. Outrage is free. It's not gonna do much, but it's free. It's not gonna do much of right here, but it's free. Here we go. We get rid of Miss Machias. Nice job. Oh, Agron comes out. I would love the earthquake this. No. Rock polish? Am I still faster? Uh, if it's max, it's, if it's max speed, it is max speed. That's definitely scary. Then I'll try you and earthquake. Ooh, thank you. Now, Rhyperior probably comes out, but I go Leafeon on that. I just go Leafeon on Rhyperior. It, it's okay, it happens. Like, it, it, it really happens. And yeah, nice, we take that, and I'm gonna double edge Houndoom. I'm gonna double edge Houndoom. Oh, we're female, that's right. Every time I see a female on a mod that's rarely female, then I get excited. Also, oh no! Crap. This might be bad. I'm gonna have to try and win with Great Beyond. I'm gonna chip this with superpower. I'm gonna die. And I'm gonna die. I, I can earthquake with Drapion, but I think I just die in one earthquake from Rhyperior. No. And, I'll, and even then it comes down to a speed tie with Drapion and Houndoom. Unless sucker unless I get in range of Sucker Punch. Depends on whether you get a crit or not, I think. Yeah, exactly. GG. It all came down to Drapion. We were close. We, we were definitely close. Oh, I still have this over here. I think every time we do DPP, I'm just gonna use this one. The first DPP team I use. What's this team style? Balanced? Is it bulky? I mean, the team is kind of bulky. They have a Houndoom and Miss Magius, which are really bulky. Miss Magius can run bulky sets. Man, Miss Magius is so good. Game. What's your favorite mod in DVP, UU? I don't really like Venusaur much. I personally prefer Leafeon. And this pairing it with a random poison type like Weezing, Drapeon, Toxic Rope. Torterra, not bad. I don't hate Torterra. I personally really like Absol in this tier. Uh, Milotic I definitely really like. Milotic and Venus. People say Venus are the best Pokemon in the tier, and Milotic is second best. I 
I'll listen to them, even though personally, I've been liking Milotic more than Venusaur. Like, Venusaur... Let me look at Venusaur right now. One, one, I remember trying a Swords against Venusaur one time. We might try that tomorrow. Just, just give me a game. I want to use the Leap Miss Bag, yes, with my Let's go. Last video was really short because I had to uh, make a detour to the bathroom. And right now I got my bathroom things hopefully settled. I don't know if they'll come back. I know you guys don't actually need to know all this stuff, but I just hope you guys understand my pain. I wonder if you guys ever felt this pain. I have this before last time. Have you guys felt this kind of pain before? It's just not funny in game. DPPU is a lot more popular than that showdown. Maybe I can make adjustments to the team. In terms of my period checking, I just need better predictor of this. Maybe a life form would be good on this. Especially with synthesis. Yeah, life form definitely. Oh, wait, why am I writing left over like that? I want a life form on you too. Life form on Drapion might be okay. I don't think so, though. I, I, I'll keep the black stars for now. I think I have life form on almost everything. My god. It's just Drapion and Miss Magius that have black spuds and focus sash. Someone is now going to shape Drapion and Miss Magius. <laughs> what would we like? Dragius? Let me see. Why are we even doing that? It's, it's a Drapion and a Miss Magius. Also, I saw the viability ranking saying that Drapion wasn't really that good. Where, where is it? Uh, if we look at the viability ranking, Drapion is ranked all the way down here among the ranks of Espeon, Entei, Altaria, Electro, Gardevoir, and all this stuff. Drapion and Primeape are a lot better than that. They're a lot better than that. Drapion and Primeape are way better than Tangrove and Needle King. It's just not fighting a game. Every time this happens, I always like, should I just end the video here? But we just have one game and that's it. Is it my Wi-Fi? Connected. I'm just bored. I guess I'll look at the viability where I can try to get better grasp of the better game. I get ooh. Oh, I just noticed we can't struggle with Reggie Steel no matter how many super effective moves we have for it. You know we have really big weaknesses to almost everything. I'm gonna run Aqua Tail on this. For the fire types, for Moltres specifically. Registeel. We already have like super effective moves for Registeel. And there we go, finally. A game. A cloister. I can just shout about this. Actually, you no, know, I don't want to reveal him for our fighting. Just in case they go. Just in case I want to sack my smaggies to something. Oyster cracker. So I'll just shout about. Does enough anyway. T spikes. I have a Drapion. I should have hit power fighting there, yeah. Oh, did you get two layers? I could take advantage of the passive cloister lead, the memento, but honestly, memento makes everything passive, so I'll just save that for later. Just, there we go. Back the you. what? Who's who joined back thing you? Spirit to him. Uh, I want to taunt it first. Let's see. Pursuit. Dark Pulse. Alright. Well, now I go for Memento. This might be like nasty to Spirit to him. I can go Drapion here and I can Swords of Arms. Drapion isn't the biggest offensive threat. It's not the very strong, which I think is holding it back. But I think we can manage. Especially against this Spiritomb. 
Let's suck up the toxic legs. Darn fan. I don't know how much a plus two aqua kill does. Where's the damage calculator? DP. Great. Oh, you use sword. You use swords there. And Dawn Fan. Uh, you use Rapid Spin, maybe? A plus two Aqua Tail. Small chance of killing. I want to try it. Uh, wow, they are real physically defensive. But that shouldn't. What? How are you physically defensive, but you still kill me? How? Well, I have Leafy on. I sit on this. I should be able to sit on you. And I think a life or leaf, a plus two life or leaf blade should take out uh, Spiritomb, who I think is a mono attacker. Maybe, maybe it's a mono attacker set with a life orb. Oh, it's already life orb. Plus two, man. One armor stronger than that, but then again, that's basically defensive. Also, they brought in an aggro apparently. Which, wow, so strong. <laughs> Yo, Leafeon is about to be a threat. Leafeon's about to be a threat. Well, female again, too. That's real cool. It's okay. It's okay. And they can slow people when they have to do with this. And make sure he doesn't have anger management. Your anger management is gone. <laughs> you should be happy about that. I punch, I can take I can take that. I can definitely take that. Your Oh, I've sent the sis. I've sent the sis. Name Torterra. Roar? What? Did not expect Roar. I'm doubling into Leafeon. And they go to the Mono Attacker Spirit Tomb. What are you gonna do? But he's typing. Let's see, I wanna see what he says. <laughs> okay, it's been a long time since I had these fun chats with people. I'm glad I found this guy. Oh, maybe he was just thinking hard. That was a lot. Man, yeah, this is definitely model attacker spirit doom. Can't really give this free turns. Leafeon is so frightening against it. You see, if I was Venusaur, I wouldn't have been able to set up as much. I wouldn't have been as strong against Spirit Doom and Torterra. Torterra would be a lot scarier. Uh, I wouldn't have been able to take Primeape as well. Dude, Leafeon. Alright, I'll send this in before they bore me into Alakazam again. I'll Psychic here. Dawnfan is, Dawn is that low art, so I guess it's down to Torterra trying to sweep. Oh, we lived the Earthquake on barely anything. I was thinking about subbing, but never mind. Look at this. Let's die together, and we'll bring in... I want to see how much Altaria can do to this. Just curious, I want to see how much damage Altaria does with a life formed Outrage coming from base 70 attack. We are, we're even adamant. But is this even going to kill? No, how bulky this was, I don't think it's going to kill. Uh, there's a chance, and we got the high roll. We did it. We did it! Yay! That was assuming that was max defense, which I think it was considering the damage from Drapion. Oh, we found a game right away. Nice. Yuxi, taunt. 
Taught the Yuxi. Taught the Yuxi. You know what? There's no point in not turning on my air conditioning right now. It is freaking hot. In power fighting, see how much we do. You don't have EV light, so you're not as bulky, but you're still bulky. So pretty bulky. Let's hope it's not spadef. Yeah, that would be really annoying. I wanna see actually. Oregon to let's try let's see, Yu Yu Defensive Duck, Miss Magias, Yu Yu Lead Thunderbolt. No, no, no Thunderbolt. And Hidden Power of Fighting against a uh, very spadef it should do that much. And it looks like it's potentially very spadef. I'll hit power fighting again. They go Azu. I'm gonna momentum against this. Go don't kill me with Aqua. Yeah, I wanna I wanna get the memento off. Yes. They go for Aqua Tail, and I can probably bring in Leafy on here and Swords Dance. As far as I see, Leafion is decently threatening against all three of these. With a Swords Dance up. With a Swords Dance up, we're pretty threatening with Leafion. They go Yuxi. Let's hope this Leaf Blade does plenty. Yeah, okay, that's, that's good. Trick Room is annoying, though. I might Swords Dance again. They Stealth Rock. Alright, so I did it, Swords Dance again. Porygon 2 comes in and kills me now, so I don't really like that because Leafy Out is threatening. And I want to keep her that way. And I said her because it's female again. We are lucky with the 12.5%. Oh, you're the same person. You know what? Glamour is too is too good. It's too scary. I don't know if I've, I don't know if I fought this person in this video or last video. Yep. <laughs> what is this? How is their Glamour so strong? Why is it so? Why is it so powerful? I must ask. It's not even specs. Because it believes in God. Bye bye, Halo. Okay, but. Okay, but for real, how? Because, I, I mean, sure, you can believe in God, but I don't think that's gonna make it that powerful. Of course, you feel self punch. Aria or break. And of course I'm just barely slower than it. Everything is great. Alright, we outspeed. And now Clan Pro comes in and destroys me because I am inferior to Clan Pro. At least that's what I think happens, right? Right? I'm inferior to Clan Pro. Hang on, I'm gonna close my fan. I, ah, I think it's But yeah, Sucker Punch, and we die. GG. Why is it so powerful? GG. Why is it so strong? Seriously. I thought she was I, I really want to know, how is your Clamp Pro so buff? There's no way a Clamp Pro can one-shot It's base 70 force. It. Oh. So they have the deep sea too? Wait, wait, is it legit? Yo, wait, we might try this out. Yo, I might try Clamper out. Trick Room Clamper <laughs> Deep Sea Tooth. What? There's nothing here. What? Why do I have that option? I might try this. Although, I'm honestly really scared of trying this. So I don't think I will, actually. 
So, let's do one last game. I think I have some time for the one last game. I want to use this team out. Memento Miss Magius has been really good so far. Leafeon, Leafeon has probably been my favorite, but everything here other than, like, Absol has been really good. Absol hasn't really done much yet. Even though I did say I like Absol in this meta game, I do like Alakazam's power and speed here. Uh, Altaria, um, it's not that strong though. Drapion is underrated. I like Drapion, I really do. I tried it in OU once and it was actually pretty good. It was actually pretty good. Nope. So, probably because no one expects it, but it's just good to me. Earth, no, plus two. Choice Man and Earth Crazy. Really shattered Drake. Really shattered Jirachi. So speaking of Choice Man, I, want, I really like Choice Man a lot more than Source Dance. But because of the momentum of his magic, I feel like Source Dance, I should give that a chance. Have I fought you yet? Ting Tong 33664. Why do I feel like it's a reference to something? Oh, wow, you're faster? Oh, it's Scarf! Hello, Scarf Yuxi. Chansey! Oh, no. I was thinking about running a substitute charge beam Rotom on this team, but I didn't. And you know, I'm gonna memento against this. Actually, I'm gonna Shadow Ball and then memento. Alright, we do nothing. They Shadow Ball me back, so I'm gonna memento here. There we go. It's got Shadow Ball and Dark Pulse. Leafeon? It can't Willow is me because it's taunted, so I think I bring in Leafeon and Source Dance. I didn't visit who I bring in. And for once, Romeo. <sighs> of course, we got the hard counter. There goes the momentum. Now my momentum is somewhat wasted. Okay, I need this to fall in the plus two double edge range. So, RK9, UU Life Orb, Leafeon, UU Source Dance. How much does the plus two double edge do? Oh, it one shot? Oh, wow, if I had known. What if it's not plus two then? No, it's not really gonna kill. And we can Zam, I guess. But then they just go Spirit Tomb. You just go Spirit Tomb. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm not stupid. You're going. I know you're going Spirit Tomb. If you Willow is me, you're. you're oh, don't Willow is me. Nasty plot. Okay. I'm going Night Slash. And Oko? Crit! Oh, Super Luck Night Slash Crit. Let's see. Sucker? Can I get a Sucker Punch off? He might try to trick me a Choice Scarf. I think he might try to trick me a Choice Scarf. Yeah. Alright, so I take away my Life Orb and gives me a Choice Scarf. I'll see if I... Is locking myself in the Night Slash not good? He doesn't have a dart with it, so he might have one for later. I get the kill on Chansey. They have a physical tank, a physical demon. Wow. Yeah, really a physical tank. And they have Intimidate Arcanine. I'm just gonna let Absol deal a bunch of damage, though. I'm just gonna let it do that. Never mind, I'm just gonna get outstalled. Zam should be able to come in at Psychic though. We should be okay to Psychic. I love how Yuxi has a Life Orb right now. It's kind of funny. Look at that. It's freaking Life Orb Yuxi. We should do a lot of damage to Tank Girls. They have a Milotic. Milotic. I guess I'll sacrifice Absol and try to get Leafeon in and start threatening damage on everything. I just don't like that they have Tank Growth. Yeah, that kind of stopped my Leafeon in his tracks. I'll bring Leaf on anyway. Try and Leaf Blade. If they go Arcanine, double edge afterwards, KOs Arcanine. They go Arcanine, double edge KOs. Ooh, but at minus one. Because I intimidate. No! Do I risk it? I'm risking it. Thank you. Thank you, Leaf Leon. What I don't like is that that Tangrove has freaking toxic. Who doesn't care about Toxic here? Drapion. So he goes Drapion. He even taunted it. That's kind of funny. I think if I Source Dance, my Crunch should kill Milo Dick. 
drape me on them. Milo, uh, Milo, do you fizz death? A plus two. If it's fizz death, it doesn't kill. Oh, wow, that's earthquake for his last move. Of course you do. Oh my god, we. Oh, what? Did I spell that wrong? Of course I did. What the heck is this? Do you fizz. What? How? How did that destroy the tank growth? It's a freaking tank growth! How did we just destroy it? Wow, how did you live that? Wow! How did we all go tank growth of all things? Maybe it wasn't the physical tank. Maybe it was Mac P and. Tank growth. You double status? Maybe with the double status and we just got a crazy high roll. Come on, kill it. Four percent. And hey, there's the non-awkward female Milotic. Let's, I want to finish it out with Aqua Tail. <laughs> I wanted to finish it with Aqua Tail, but it's fine. That was an incredible game. Drapion, shout out to Drapion, shout out to Leapion, and shout out to Memento Miss Magius. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Have a great day. Peace.